So this is Lee's Ferry. This is uh, an important spot on the Colorado River. For most visitors, this is the only spot within 700 miles of canyon where you can actually uh, get down and touch the, the Colorado River. For rafters, this is the beginning of the adventure. And then, very important spot as well for the hydrology, the, the economy, and the politics of Western North America. Lee's Ferry is one of few measurement sites, and it is the most important site for measuring the flow of water through the Colorado River. So what you may be able to see on this image is a, a ball dangling from a, from a wire. That's so that you can see the cable where the U.S. Geological Survey measures the flow of water down the Colorado River. All the seven different states that rely upon Colorado River water, as well as uh, Mexico, they watch the amount of flow coming through Lee's Ferry on a daily basis because that determines how much water they are able to draw to come out of taps, to fill swimming pools, to, to irrigate fields and everything else. And that depends on measurements and measurements that are actually pretty heroic to take. That uh, in order to measure the flow and, and update it, someone has to get out there periodically, it's, it's every few weeks or months, and dangle from that cable in a cage and drop down a, a, a sounding, uh, it's a depth measurement device and, and a current meter, um, take a number of measurements across the channel, and that is on a happy, calm day and during an intense flood as well. So I, I'm not sure I would want to be the guy dangling over the Colorado River during a raging flood like the few that have happened in the past. For me, uh, Lee's Ferry was the beginning of a uh, nearly three week long adventure down the Grand Canyon. This spot's the last time you see a vehicle get a cell phone signal for up to three weeks. 